first official day of fashion week. First show is for Bronx and Banco, and I'm so excited for this dress. <laughs> She's gorgeous. Let's put her on, shall we? Oh my god. I have no words. What sold me on this was this ruffle train. Like, look at this. This is crazy. I love it. It's just amazing. Plain gold hoops. I was going to do no necklace, but I could... I don't know. I just don't love this with it. Oh my god, wait. I really did not think I packed this. One of those ones, like, specifically made for v-necks. Oh my god, it's literally perfect. I don't know where my Dior sling back. Wait, why do these look actually terrible with them? I guess we'll try these. Yes, these are much better. Train on this is just like insane. Black bag. Okay, what do we think? I think we're ready. I love you guys so much. Fashion week, day two. Getting ready for Alice and Olivia. This might be one of my favorite looks. And I was at my fitting for them. I fell in love with this the second I saw it. First of all, these shorts fit me amazingly. Matching blazer. I really like it with nothing under. For comfort reasons, I think I'm gonna wear a bralette. And I have two different ideas. I was thinking some kind of curls. I have this choker, I have a long one, but I also love this bow tie look that Blake Lively did. First, I need to brush out my curls because yesterday I fully went to the Bronx and Mako show with unbrushed curls. Maybe that doesn't seem like a big deal to you. Uh, it's a massive deal for me. Okay, I like the idea. It just needs to be better. I have these sparkly bobby pins that I could put on it. But before we go any further, I need to see how the pearls look. I wrap them. Okay, so that's a no. I think the bralette is really just the problem. These look like... Oh, that could be sick. I do really like these. I kind of like both. I think we're doing both. I'm just gonna do tall black boots. Oh my god. I'm fucking obsessed with this. It just feels like very classic Hannah. You're definitely ready. I love you guys so much. Let's get ready for the Love Shack Fancy Show. I'm such a Love Shack fan. Everything I've been to for them has been incredible. Um, more importantly, this dress is incredible. It's entirely embellished with pearls, bow sleeves. It's perfect. Anyways, definitely these little pearl earrings. I should do layered pearls. One strand or none. Because there's already, like, it's already... Okay, we're just gonna do one. But for my hair, do we just, like, pin it back? If we did a braid and... Like, should I do it like this? Or should I put it under the rest? Like that. I kind of like it on top. Okay. I actually really like this. Maybe I'm just gonna wear my Jimmy Choo's again. Do your perfume and look. My name is engraved on it. How cute is that? This? I I don't know. Feels a little much, but we, we, I think we have to. <laughs> We have a couple more things to go to tonight. I have been saving this for months. She's finally gonna see a night out. Definitely deserves to be seen. I also just put my hair up like to get it out of my face, but I honestly might leave it. Either do satin mini skirt, or I kind of feel like this could be cool. Might be too high-waisted. Yeah, the satin definitely looks better, but we could also do leather. Because if I did leather, I could also wear a leather jacket. Do I even want to wear a jacket? I don't know. In the meantime, I'm just gonna darken up my eyes and add some eyeliner. Okay, now the question is, do we accessorize with gold? Maybe these hoops. Or do we do... I literally can't pick. Always do sparkly. Let's, let's, let's do something different. I was really thinking it was gonna be leather, but I think I like the satin better. This is what I wore. <laughs> to... The thing. Me? No. That was fully <laughs> yesterday. <laughs> and I was wearing black boots. They're not in... I'm not wearing them anymore. Do you want to What? Pasta? Sip. Oh. <laughs> Clearly had a great time. Love you guys. Okay, we have an event for Revolve tonight. And they sent me a dress to wear. A week ago, they said it's an options, like stuff you would be willing to wear. Every single one of them is black, <laughs> except for this. I really didn't think they were going to send this, but I'm excited to wear something different. <laughs> I'm not laughing at the dress. The dress is beautiful. I'm laughing because I'm the one wearing it. Could either be subtle with the accessories and do like just like these little strappy heel, but we would just run with this chaos and do these platforms. What do we think of these shoes? I think these shoes are the only option. And rhinestone hoops. Should we be just like so obnoxious and wear clubs? Like okay, with the shoes. I'm gonna bring them. Maybe like just for a photo. This is the bag. Let's hit it. Designing. 
anyways i'm home and the gallery was amazing so many questions about this dress on my story it's a part of the new mbd collection and you can shop it on revolve love you guys oh my god yes i wear a lot of black clothing and i will continue to however I did wear a pink dress last week and i actually really liked it so i guess we can keep it going and these are really fucking sick do this or just like straight across the pants look kind of magenta on camera there's no like bright hot pink let's try the other one this is a lot more flattering i feel like hot pink lips would look really sick with this well, let's see what we can do do we not have anything pink what the fuck I did find this in my backpack oh it's more like red do you know what i need my old competitive chair lipstick would have been perfect Wow, after all that, they look less pink than usual. Sparkly earrings, go figure. Actually, I haven't even worn these yet. But if I did gold, then I could wear this choker. Never mind. I think the choker is too much. Or we could do this with this. No, definitely this. Okay, I'm like really loving this. Pointed toe boots. Also, these are the pants that I was talking about in my last YouTube video. The real ones now. Y'all also know who inspired this. Doing a jacket. Honestly, I think the jacket kind of takes away. I just wear it like this one, right? Like, the fact that I was fully about to leave holding a black bag. What's wrong with me? Oh. I am so sorry. Oh, you can kind of see the pants color better right here. I think this is like perfect. Everything like coordinates very well. I really fuck with these pink pants. I think we're ready. Love you guys. We need to get dressed because I'm in Milan for fashion week, which does not feel real coming out of my mouth. I have a show tonight and I am so honored for Hugo Boss and not okay. Obviously I picked one of their amazing suits to wear. I can't believe that I'm in Italy to be attending something this crazy. I don't have words other than like my dreams coming true, which like, okay, I'm gonna shut up about it now, but I am just so thankful to be here. I don't know how I feel about my suits and it does not get better than this. It's like massive. Little black slingbacks. Also, we need some appreciation for the fit of these pants because they're insane. I might wear this one again that like goes down the middle. We also have this boss tote that we're gonna carry. This is really doing it for me. Let's go. This is fucking crazy. Time to get ready for the after party. Show was incredible. Wasn't planning on changing, but I think we're gonna wear this Mugler dress. Also, <laughs> not just because I cheered for so long, but I can't wear dresses or skirts without Nike Pros underneath. I think the hair's just gonna have to go into a bun. But I actually wore this twice during New York Fashion Week, both <laughs> after parties. I never filmed in it, and that's why I brought it to Milan. But I think it's just gonna be my designated after party dress for when I don't know what to wear. This Charlotte Tilbury powder will make your makeup look like you just put it on, no matter how long it's been on your face. A whole bunch of that. I don't know why my eye makeup refuses to stay on my eyes, but I don't have time to fix it. Isn't this dress just like so like, it's very flattering. I mean, it's Mugler, so it better be flattering. It's cold outside, but I didn't bring sheer tight. So I guess we're just gonna wear tall boots and hope for the best. Hydrating. Didn't bring very many bag options. So this wet earrings. In case you wanted to know, this dress is very comfortable. It's definitely on the trendier side, but I've already gotten so many wears out of it because I needed to make it worth it. I am on wearing it a lot more because I really love it. It was the full effect. We're ready to go. Love you guys. We're in Paris, so we need to get dressed. It's kind of really freezing here. Also, it might rain today. I personally hate the rain with my entire existence. Since the rain happens to be in Paris, I think we'll be okay. I am here for Paris Fashion Week. Well, first of all, this was a terrible idea. I don't have anything going on today. I think the plan is just to shop, eat, explore. Okay, I'm actually hating this top. Should we do a turtleneck? Yes. God, I love turtlenecks. Wait, maybe now the vest would look good, we think. Also, this vest is so sick. It's Armani, and I got it on the Real Real for like $60. Speaking of the Real Real, if you have any like vintage shopping recommendations for Paris, let me know. It's also my first time ever in Paris. I feel like these Converse really just killed the entire vibe. I didn't bring my chunky boots because I wanted to find new ones here. Hopefully I find some today and I can change while we're out. And accessories light. Okay, other than Converse, I really fuck with this. I think we're ready. And I'll let you know if I find any black boots. Love you guys. It's Paris Fashion Week and we have a party to go to. Some of you might remember these pants. Not these for Coachella. A lot of you were very angry with me for not wearing them. Rightfully so, because these are sick as fuck. Since then, I've been waiting for the perfect occasion to wear them. So much so that they've been in my suitcase on every single trip that I've been on since. And tonight's the night. I also think that they weren't right to style for summer. Two ideas. Leather jacket. If I don't like this, I'll try a turtleneck. I'm hoping this is gonna be perfect. I do love this jacket. I don't know if this cut is right. For shits and giggles, this is what the jacket was originally going to be. These are the boots. 
this is really coming together. <laughs> it's making me really fucking happy because I'm tired of hauling these pants around. The hard part is accessories. I don't think I can wear gold with this. I could also say that makes it easier because we don't have very many to choose from. It's either hoops or some kind of sparkly earrings but i don't know if that's really what the vibe here oh i've oh, can't just wear silver hoops i can't do it i wish i had like an, a more understated sparkly necklace because like this isn't gonna cut it pre-game Honestly, I'm kind of torn between the jackets. This is frumpy, but it's a good kind of frumpy. This is definitely on the more put together side. I can't, I can't decide. I guess we'll see which one I pick tonight. Okay, update. I wore the fitted one. Despite the way I look in this photo, I felt amazing all night. And I think this is one of my favorite outfits ever. It is day two of Paris Fashion Week. This dress is just, first of all, it's a little mini dress. But the back. Look at this shit. This is Fucking adorable. I actually real stressed at New York Fashion Week. Uh, I didn't get any pictures in it, so it doesn't count. Look. The back is amazing, but I honestly love just the mini dress part. Like, I want the mini dress, just the mini dress. I'm really glad I'm getting another wear out of it. It also feels very much more Paris. When I wore it in New York, I wore my slingback. But I have these. What? And these Where did are... Those come from? These are like... My babies, but as beautiful as they are, they do feel like more of a casual shoe. Like, I don't know if you can tell, but this is like cloth. I really love them. And I really don't mind them with this dress. They need their own moment. Yeah, see, I think we stick with the sling back. The dress is enough by itself. Actually, it's not. Hold on. The time I bought these on the real real. I was scrolling. Look at this fucking clutch that I are you kidding me? And it's vintage Valentino. Got it for a, under $100. Maybe my hair should be up. Hair tie, I just took it off my wrist. I don't, I thought I was gonna like it, but I really don't. Leaving the hair down. Clutch. I don't think I can, I don't think I can get any better. I don't think I can get better than this. How many times am I gonna fucking slaughter? I don't think I can get any better than this. I think we're ready. I love you guys so much. It is day three of Paris Fashion Week. We have a party for Jean-Paul Gaultier. That's fucking crazy. I've had this thing for a while. I don't know how to style it without looking. I don't know. I want to look classy, but like hot. It's very cool. The moral of the story is I didn't know how to style it while doing it justice. But I found this Reformation skirt. I haven't tried it on with this, but I think it's going to work. I kind of love it. Hold on. I think it's okay. Like, I think I like it. It's either these feel a little like not right for this or these which also don't feel right for this. I don't know if I love them, but I feel like they're really the only choice. I really wanted either to put ribbon in my hair or around my neck. So I went to the cutest knitting store. I found this ribbon. What if we finally made the neck ribbon work? I mean, from this framing right here, I think it looks great. Wow, I'm so glad I just spent 20 minutes on this damn fish tail for it to look terrible. I also definitely am keeping this. I actually do have time to at least try a bun. Now that I'm taking out, like, I'm like, I kind of like it. Wait, <laughs> I don't know what to do. It's gonna have to be a fishtail sleigh tonight, and I think it looks good. I don't know if I believe that, but that's what I'm telling myself. I think it works. I think everything works very nicely together. Really glad I waited to wear this top, but we gotta go, so I guess this is it. Love you guys. First fashion week, day four. Today, I'm so excited. I have an event with Love Shack Fancy. Anytime we go to a Love Shack event, I just feel like I'm playing dress up. This white set that we're going to wear. How cute is this? Normally, something like this, I'd probably do like monochromatic and just do all white. I think I want to accessorize with black. I do think that I want to wear these. I honestly even do black tights. Tights are on. You could either do a black bow. I really wanted to wear like a neck scarf. This kind of vibe. I couldn't find one. Or we do this headband, and I kind of like the headband. I also want to wear some kind of gloves. I have these that are like fishnet which i think ew. we have these leather which kind of ew no love mixing leather with like uh girly let me know why i have so many fucking gloves these are a little long so i don't think you'd even be able to s yeah <laughs> that looks terrible i guess we do the leather ones definitely pearls cute i could do this long no what if we put it no Let's wrap it again. Oh, I really like the way this layer. I don't know if it'll stay like that. Maybe I could tie two of the strands together. I kind of like it, honestly. What do we think? Or we could just okay, also stick to the thinner. First of all, another Love Shack win. This is an incredible party. This is the look for the party. However, I did have to all around this coat because I'm sick of my feet hurting. So I did pull me. I did bring my boots so that I could wear them. And that 
that's the vibe tonight. Love you guys.